Great news! The tenth time I put you away, the beating is free! Move in on that hat now. They try to kill me, and then they look so surprised when I beat them up. Ten forty three. Police vehicles under armed assault. Nearest officer, please proceed to Manhattanville. Requesting status update okay, from the MJ, mile. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Mayor Osborne really lives here? I never see him. There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. I left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. Hey, let us back upstairs. I've got a medical emergency here. Oh, man. I can't breathe. Let me Why back isn't upstairs. Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. Ugh. Every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs! That should do it. Crap. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Let us upstairs before we all catch the disease! Security room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frontline. Hello? I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. Way out of here. We're in charge now. Okay, okay, I'm gone. <sighs> Multi-million dollar. <laughs> I like this thing. Gotta turn him around. Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers work elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Continue. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire it. Stupid. 
stupid, useless button. <sighs> Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Whoa. This mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. Work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Doors are locked till the system check finishes. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> So weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. The fat Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. Norman could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. This room smells like... rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. <sighs> Forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms. And a motto. Pax in Bello. Peace in War. <sighs> Gotta remember that if I ever write a book about all of this. Norman locked up Harry's room, wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? Looks like Norman locked up Harry's room. I wonder why. City's in a state of emergency, but Norman still manages to get his laundry and cleaning done for him. <laughs> what a hero. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just 
wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway, listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad, you know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Emily's terminal diagnosis. I know Harry's mom was sick, but I had no idea it was genetic. Did Harry ever get tested? Happy birthday, dear. Sorry, I'm a little late. It's been a busy month. I miss you, Em. Especially today. I've put Harry... I've sent him away. For treatment. We'll fix him, Em. I promise. Development of GR-27 was too slow to save you. It won't fail Harry. I'm keeping his room. Exactly as it is, ready for when he gets back. The key is with you, Em. I know you keep it safe. Wait, Norman sent Harry away for treatment? I thought he went to Europe on his own. What were you hiding from us, Harry? Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Norman's bathroom is bigger than my entire apartment. Now I feel sad. Ugh. Norman would have a pool. New York is about subway rats and street pizza, not sunbathing and umbrella drinks. be so carefree. I miss those days. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. Kinda cute. Norman keeps all the campaign buttons from his races. There's one for school board, 
and he's left room for more. Setting your sights higher, Norman? Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. for Harry, can it? Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney, like his mom. Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Okay, July 18. Bingo. Sue, gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. medical records. GR-27 was developed to treat them. Devil's Breath is a failed cure for Norman's own family. Norman Osborne, GR-27 research log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease, but try telling that to the evening news. 
Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Devil's Breath isn't a disease. It's an attempt at a cure? I almost can't believe it. Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like the Upper West Side. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. <sighs> Kinda makes sense, though. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. And Sable troop deployments. <sighs> They're stationed all over the city. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. None of these patrols cross Dr. Michael's path. Nope, that's just a Sable patrol. Bet I'm looking for a heavily guarded Oscorp building that Dr. Michaels visits. Oscorp building, but no Michaels or Sable. That's not it. Dr. Michaels went to this Oscorp building, but there's no security detail. This can't be it. Commercial buildings... Wow. So many records. Oscorp's going all in on defense research. Where do these three categories overlap? That must be the lab's location. Bravo, bravo, bravo. And this must be the C team. No, Dr. Michaels was near a lot of Sable forces, but it's not an Oscorp facility. Dr. Strom, isn't he a robotics expert? No movement from Dr. Van Adder. Must be out of the city. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Wherever the anti-serum is, he must have been too. No. Nor a records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath lab. Oscorp's going all in on defense research. No. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath lab. Good old Alpha team. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. GR-27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR-27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! Who's there? Oh, no.
Damn it. We have a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. to clear that balcony. You're amazing. <laughs> it's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You... you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks. Partner. I have 
have to get that anti-serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. Okay, Norman's on his way to get the anti-serum. Better update Yuri. I hope this is good news. It is. Oscorp just created an anti-serum. There's a cure? Oh, thank God. How quickly can we get it to people? I'm on my way to find out. The lab is at 10th and Cathedral. Wait. I just got a report of a helicopter going down in that area. Oh no. That could be Norman's helicopter. I'd send officers your way, but I don't have any. Don't worry. I'm on it. This'll all be over soon, I promise. <laughs>